Hi everybody, it's Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Session. Someone had requested a tutorial on how to make um, like your shadow layers. Um, so what I went in and did is I brought up my text tool and then I just texted out the letters uh, of the words that I want and then in the font that I want. And then you're going to come up here to effects. Okay, first let me back up. If you want to um, if you want to uh, join these letters together um, to weld them or union them so that they are all touching and it's all one piece go ahead and do that because if not when you uh, do your shadow layer your top part will be individual letters okay so you're going to go through here and just bring these letters till they're touching and then we're going to go up and union them. So I'm going to pause this so you don't have to watch all this. Okay, so they're all placed together. And we come up here and we click our preview. And you see they're still all individual. So let's come back here. And we're going to come up here to path. We're going to click union. And that will join them all together. Now let's come up to our preview and you see they're all joined together. So that way, like I said, when you do your shadow effects, you don't have to worry about independently piecing those letters together unless you want to. If you want to, then do not union them. Okay, so once that's done, come up to your effects and your shadow layer. All right, that just put one layer behind this. Okay, let me show you here. Okay, your preview. You see you have two layers. If that's all you want, that's fine. You can come back up here um, and you can click another one, but you're going to bring it up to make it a little bit bigger. Okay, let's hit OK there and see what that looks like. Okay, you see it's almost too big. So, let's go back and add in one like this. Okay. Come back up to our preview. Ah, that's perfect. Okay, so what you want to do instead of doing that, because I wanted to do that to show you, um, when you come up here to your effects, do this one, layer count, take it up to two. Hit OK, and then there you go. Let's come up to our preview and see. See, there you have all kinds of layers. Alright, so that's how you do shadow layering in scale. Um, I will come back and we'll do one in Canvas. Okay, so here we are in Canvas. And I just went over here and got one of their um, words that's already joined together. And we're going to come up here to Edit, Create Offset Line. Now the first one, when it comes up already, is at point 2 and it's outward. And then um, the original line, leave as is. And you select OK. And there's that one. Alright, so we're going to come up here and we're going to do the same thing. If you want, uh, you know, as many layers as you want, this is how many times you'll do it. But you're going to change this. So you're going to bring it up to, I usually do point 0.4. Okay, and I click OK. I try to keep the numbers even. There you go. So that's how you do the shadow layer in 